So Nicholas begins reporting Princess Beatrix's issue elected Memphis boyfriend speaking and Princess Beatrix's issue elected American boyfriend speaking. There is a quote in the Bible that is expressed being blessed and highly favored. Well, Nicholas Begis this afternoon is blessed and highly favored. Today, I was on a conference call with the White House and, of course, the Center of Disease Control regarding the Ebola crisis. Now, Nicholas Begis is in his mid-20s, and to be on a conference call with the White House is truly a great honor and great privilege. And, of course, for um, the White House to always express that the First Lady likes Nicholas Begis and is a fan of Nicholas Begis, where I consider her a global advocate of Nicholas Begis, supporting me as a CNN. I kind of miss this is a true blessing, and I am blessed and highly favored, as it is always expressed in the Bible, as Princess Beatrix elected Mrs. Boyfriend and Princess Beatrix elected American Boyfriend. Nicholas Begis reporting, today is, and we are in a biblical season. I would like to pray for the first patient who passed away this, after, this morning regarding Ebola in the great state of Texas. I am, of course, holding in my hand the unopened letter. For the First Lady of the United States, as you can see, it's still unopened. Nicholas Pegues is impacting my generation in many ways, and I want them to always um, focus upon international issues. I will like as many views as possible in honor of us going against Ebola. Now, this crisis is, can get very, very bad, and every view will be in honor of us standing against Ebola. So stand against Ebola with the unopened letter of the First Lady of the United States, Sir Nicholas Fugues. And also to impact this is my, of course, papal signature. I never revealed to many people for Pope Benedict the 16th. He was an absolute great pontiff. Nicholas Fugues reporting, Princess Beatrix is your elected Memphis boyfriend speaking, and your elected American boyfriend speaking. Nicholas Fugues, living abundantly, blessed and highly favored in a great state of Tennessee. Nicholas Fugues reporting. Thank you, First Lady Michelle Obama. Of course, you are a global advocate, a CNN icon, Nicholas Fugues. So Nicholas Fugues reporting, CNN, our reporter on Memphis. Inspire my generation of public service here at the Amazon Fulfillment Center in Chattanooga, Tennessee. And look at the crowd out here. So many people out here ready to hear President Barack Obama. Yes, that's President Barack Obama to speak to the audience here in the great state of Tennessee. So President Obama, I told you, I was your pit high. CNN Hour. So Nicholas Piggies reporting, CNN Hour Report on Memphis, famous for being Piggies, here with Mayor A.C. Wharton. What do you have to say to Memphis and what do you think about President Barack Obama coming here to Chattanooga? Well, it's great to be here to welcome him, uh, to let him know uh, the good things that are happening under his administration. Uh, the, the recovery uh, is here. Uh, jobs are being produced every day. Uh, good paying jobs. Everything that lines up with what the president is talking about in terms of rebuilding and fortifying the middle class. Uh, this is Exhibit A. I just want to congratulate him. All the good folks here in Chattanooga, Mayor Burke and all of his colleagues. But most of all, I say thanks to President Obama and to thank him for the great work he's doing. Absolutely. And I want to campaign to bring more love back to Tennessee politics. You're a good guy, Mayor A.C. Wharton. Let's get it done. Nicholas Fugues reporting. How did you feel with traveling President Obama today? Uh, it was fantastic to get to spend a few minutes with the President. That's a uh, once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. And, and Awesome job. I'm trying to bring more love back to Tennessee politics, so that's what we need, more right. love. Thank CNN Hour Report. Hope we thank you. Thank you. Huh? Thank you. Yeah. Nicholas Figueres reporting, CNN Hour Report on Memphis, here with Zach Lump, you know, one of this Congressman Fincher this year. So we would like to uh, just welcome President Barack Obama here to Chattanooga. First Democratic president to come to Chattanooga in almost 50 years, so it's a, it's a compliment to Chattanooga, and we're grateful for his visit. I thought he struck a pretty good tone for a red state, and uh, frankly, it was well received. I think it's good. We're trying to bring more love back to Tennessee oh, politics. That's right. Thank, Thank you. you. Seeing it out. Nicholas Fugues reporting, 
Prince Harry here in Memphis, Tennessee, and of course, Princess Beatrix, I am your elected American boyfriend. Promoted on Facebook. Let us be your border. Here he comes. Right behind the Nicholas Reese reporting. Seen in Icon of Memphis. There he is. Nicholas Reese reporting. Princess Beatrix is his elected American boyfriend. Documenting this. It was Prince Harry. Awesome, awesome. Nicholas McGee's reporting. All right. And here we are in Memphis, Tennessee. Nicholas McGee's reporting. Documenting Prince William and Prince Harry on Nicholas McGee's. God save the Queen. And Princess Beatrix, I am your elected American boyfriend. Only on Nicholas McGee's. CNN Icon of Memphis. Excuse me.